lasted than any other Florida county six months after rioters stormed the Capitol. The seventh Brevard County resident accused of illegally entering the Capitol in January is a school teacher and a coach. And now New Six's James Barbero is finding out the school district is now putting that employee on leave as he faces federal charges. He's the high school teacher and coach who could spend three years in jail for what the FBI says he did in Washington, D.C. on January 6th. In the crowd inside the U.S. Capitol, the FBI says surveillance shows 54-year-old Ken Rita entering the building and walking around for 10 minutes before he leaves. The feds say GPS data from Rita's phone shows he spent a total of 59 minutes on restricted grounds. Brevard Public School says Rita is a gym teacher at Vieira High School where he's also been a football and track and field coach. Brevard Schools now says Coach Rita is on leave pending a district investigation. We learned that he was arrested uh, yesterday. Russ Brune with School District Communication says Rita has worked for Brevard Schools for seven years. When the FBI says he was inside the U.S. Capitol, that was a school day back in Vieira. The FBI coming to Brevard County after it says it received anonymous tips. Later, the FBI says it found Rita admitting to being at the Capitol in his social media writings. Will the district make any comments taking a stance on the allegations, or will the district vocally be neutral until we have an outcome in the investigation? We just kind of wait and see what our investigators find. That would go to the school board and go from there. So, Mr. Rita, do you have anything to say about the charges against you? Out on bond and leaving the federal courthouse in Orlando yesterday, Rita told News 6 he has no comment about his charges and that the courts will decide what happens. In Vieira, Brevard County, I'm James Sparvero, getting results News 6.